This is an older video from 2018 when Dave and I went on a backpacking trip in the Los Padres National Forest in California. This was my very first backpacking trip and Dave's first in over 25 years. The trail we were about to do was called Manzana Schoolhouse Trail. Out and back, it was over 20 miles. There were various designated places to camp along the trail. The trail had two historic landmarks, a cabin and schoolhouse from the late 1800s. The weather was perfect and spring wildflowers were in bloom. We were so excited to start hiking. I had rented a backpack from REI for this trip because I didn't own a backpack. I wasn't sure if I'd ever want a backpack again after this trip, so I figured renting one would be the best option. In hindsight, I wish I hadn't done it because I ended up getting severe bruising on my shoulders and my hips because this backpack was not the right size. Dave ended up using an old backpack that he had, and as you can see, he's having a little bit of a hard time getting it on but remember, this backpack is probably about 20 to 30 pounds in weight, and it's not as easy as it looks to get it on. Eventually, he did get his backpack on, got it all situated, and we headed out on the trail. into the trail we started hitting a lot of water we crossed stream after stream after stream after stream we ended up taking our hiking boots off and opting for our crocs which we wore for the remainder of the trail to make these water crossings much faster and easier We loved all the water crossings. It helped us to keep cool as we hiked, and it also gave us plenty of spots to restock our water supplies. Eight miles later, we arrived at Manzana Schoolhouse Camp. We were tired, sore, and ready to set up our tent and relax for the remainder of the evening. Okay, day one. Day one. It's about 6.30 right now. We hit the trail at 10, 10 o'clock. Around 10, yeah. So what are some of the highlights that you'd like to share? I think the, the fact that we got here you know we're it's about eight and a half miles a little over eight and a half miles in to this place where we're at the Monzana schoolhouse campground and honestly I wasn't sure we were gonna make it so it's good that we did and um, we're both doing okay we might actually be able to hike tomorrow maybe <laughs> maybe. <laughs> maybe a little ibuprofen maybe a little vitamin I <laughs> Let's talk about how many stream crossings we did today. <laughs> about uh, 29 or 30. I would but, say any of them, you don't have to get your feet wet if you find the right place, but 
Crocs rock. This is what I have been wearing all day on this hike because of the stream crossings. I didn't even wear my hiking boots. I've got um, bruising all right here and bruising on both sides of my hips because no matter how much adjusting I do, it's just not fitting me correct. I'm five feet, so um, I'm just a short little thing. My pack was okay. I, had, I bought it for packing camera gear around. It's, it's actually a mountain climber pack and not necessarily a, a backpacking pack. We're on a little trail system, so we could either stay put, we can hike up the Sisquak River three miles, we could walk up, walk up the hike Sisquak River five miles. Going up in elevation, right? Just slightly. After, yeah. after this. It's, yeah. We've been going downhill most of the day, but now we're gonna be going uphill. Yeah, look at the view behind us. Yep. <laughs> look at that. I mean, come on, beautiful, right? Yeah. It's that beautiful green California mountain in the background. <laughs> I guess, um, so that's the plan. So we, you know, we'll head somewhere or nowhere. <laughs> <laughs> we'll let you know tomorrow. <laughs> This turkey just flew into the tree right there. I don't know if you can see it. Flew out from the grass, scared the crap out of me. Thought it was the end of my life.
about four miles of one of the most beautiful hikes I've ever done, we arrived at a very secluded camp spot for the night. 3.50 p.m. We um, hiked about four, four and a miles, half, yeah. four miles. <laughs> <laughs> so much cheese in that one. I <laughs> know, that was so <laughs> cheesy, I love it. Yeah, we had uh, got a little off trail at the last part of the trail because the trail got, it just disappeared, so we couldn't find it. It was about 400 foot elevation gain today. Yeah. It's not too bad, but all of that 400 feet was like flat, 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 and then we were going up some pretty steep stuff, so. You get to walk through some really beautiful scenery, though. There, mm. there are these grassy um, plateaus up on the side of the canyon that were just gorgeous, you know, sprinkled with oak trees and, uh, you know, just flat grass about knee high. It was just beautiful. Mm-hmm. We're gonna do a tick inspection later because that's tick real estate right there. And then tomorrow we're just gonna head on back, start heading back. So we figure we need to do six miles tomorrow and then six miles the next day to get back to our car. Okay, we're just gonna relax uh, the rest of the afternoon, do whatever we want. Because we're on vacation. <laughs> <laughs> that's right, just enjoy this sunshine and the breeze and, and yeah, definitely gonna take advantage of the river. I think I'm gonna go just Soak my whole body in it. Yep. <laughs> okay, well, we'll see you guys later. All right, bye. So we made really good time. I want to try and beat my eight mile a day record and go for nine miles today. It's just gorgeous out here. I don't really want to go home. I don't think I'm going to be filming much just because I want to try and go as fast as far as I can. So we'll see you later.
Okay, we uh, made it to camp at 10 miles for the day. Uh, we are pretty beat. What else do we want to say? Oh, we got trail names. <laughs> My trail name is Spooky, and you have to tell them why. Because she spooks at her everything, including her own self. <laughs> uh, Dave's name is Beetle. You got to tell them why. Because he was the leader for most of the trail. Every time there was a beetle in the path, he'd say beetle, and so that I wouldn't step on it and kill it because I love the beetles and he loves the beetles, so. Beetle. Spooky. Spooky. Tomorrow we only have three miles till we go home, so. <laughs> Tomorrow's the last day. But it's been awesome. Okay, bye. Bye. I have officially changed Dave's trail name to Einstein. I wasn't really quite set on Beetle. But it's Einstein. I love it because his hair gets all crazy when he backpacks and camps. And then his glasses and he's always coming up with smart things. And he's like a cross between MacGyver and Einstein. There, I love it. Today we only have like three miles. And so um, I thought I'd take an opportunity to talk about our highs and lows of the whole trip to end off with. What was your low of the whole trip? When you lost your <laughs> poop tickets <laughs> and her poop shovel. <laughs> That's one of the basic necessities that you always keep track of. <laughs> what was your high? Oh man, that's so hard. I guess when getting up on top of the the shoulders of the canyon and with the uh, the, gra the grass. Shut up. <laughs> the grass and <laughs> the trees and. That was my high. <laughs> Maybe right now is my low, yeah. <laughs> so my low is when Dave's <laughs> in a bad mood in the morning. <laughs> I don't like it. <laughs> my low is losing my poop tickets. High of the trip. Nah, it's really hard. I can't just pick one. I just can't. Well, say something. I can't. I can't <laughs> say something. Uh, say something. <laughs> uh, there's nothing that. There was all the high. Okay, I'm not Einstein. Anything about the trip. <laughs> freaking Einstein nothing. over here. Jeez, man. <laughs> okay, the ever-changing scenery. And the... See, there you go. That oh was my hour, gosh, was just be quiet. <laughs> <laughs> all right, I would say the ever-changing scenery, all, I didn't think it was going to be this beautiful, but it's gorgeous. And, um, doing it. Just doing it. Anyway, yeah, that's it. So, um... Oh, there's a smile. Thank you. The end of the video. Thank you very much. A smile from my husband. <laughs>
All right, well, hopefully it wasn't poison oak and just was grass or some other leaf. I don't know. We'll find out in a couple days. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> And so concludes our backpacking trip. We had hiked over 25 miles and had an elevation gain of 2,000 feet. This was five months before we would sell everything we owned and move into a 29-foot RV to hit the road full-time. We traveled full-time for two years and you can watch those videos on this channel. We had to have a Supai reservations in 2020 but COVID happened and we both had health challenges we needed to address. Our future plans are to make it to Havasu Pai, as well as summer overlanding trips around the western states. Thank you for watching, and we will see you again in one of our next adventures. <laughs>